how to take a 2017 radiator out of a 2017 Ford Escape. Looks like this. First you take the hood off. There's four nuts, two on each side. I would use a 10 millimeter socket to take them off with. Next you take these little plugs out. They look like this. There's a bunch of them as you see. There's five there, four there, and then four, one, two, three, four, five more. They go across here. Yeah. Four across there. And then you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine across here. Probably not nine. It just looks that way. Next, you have seven screws to take out right here, here, here. Again, 10 millimeter is best to use. Here, 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 and here. Now we have these two little screws that go in right here. It's a seven millimeter. One right here and one right here. Right here and right here. This is to take the bumper off. So next we have more down here. Seven millimeters. As you see there's six here. And six on the other side. Next, it's these four bolts right here, here, they look like this. There's one light and one dark, and here and here. Next, you take one of these and pull out these two rubber pieces right here, just like this. I wouldn't recommend you put this on there, but that's how I do it. And one right here. Actually, three bolts. See it back in there. That's the last one. It's not a bolt, but it's a little rubber piece that you have to pop out. Next, you have to take the bumper pieces off to get the bumper off. Do you take the headlights off, which is one of these, one of these, and a bolt right here on each side. Take a number 10 and loosen the two bolts right here and two on the other side for the bumper. There's more bolts underneath the bumper, size 7 millimeter. Get all of those off. Okay, now that you've got your bumper off, you've got four nuts that you got to take off. One there, one below it, same one that's out there and there. They may differentiate. One's a 15 on this one on one side and a 13 on the other side. be continued in part two.